Hi friends! So you know, when I was a kid, caramel pudding was one of my favorite sweet dish. I'm sure it must have been yours too. So let's go with the video. Let's make it simple and easy with four basic ingredients. Here is half liter boiled milk. This milk should be at room temperature and shouldn't be hot. Here are four eggs beaten. Then we also need vanilla syrup. This is one teaspoon of vanilla syrup. This is easily available in the market. Here is 250 grams of icing sugar or powdered sugar. So now we have the four beaten eggs. In this, we will pour the half liter milk. We need to whisk the eggs and the milk well. Then we add the icing sugar. And whisk it well again. Your all the sugar is dissolved in the milk. And then we put the vanilla syrup and mix it again. The vanilla syrup will kill the egg smelt. The mixture is ready. Very quick, isn't it? So now we're going to start with the very important part of caramelizing. For this, I have taken butter in the bowl. This will be the vessel I will be using for making the pudding. I've rubbed the butter well across the sides of the bowl. I don't need to do that at the bottom because I will be anyway melting the butter with sugar for caramelization. Yeah, I think my vessel is well greased. Okay, I keep it on a slow flame gas and add a small chunk of butter. Now, as the butter starts melting, I will put this is like two tablespoon powdered sugar. I have kept the gas on slow flame so that the butter doesn't burn the sugar. It is a slow process. I need to make this dark brown. Also, very important. Before you start this process, you need to be ready with the bowl of water, which I forgot to mention. Butter has melted and it's turned brown. I don't want to burn this once it's light brown in color. I will lift this vessel off the gas and place it in this cold water so that it hardens. The sugar has hardened here. We leave it in this cold water for some time. So here is the setup for cooking the caramel pudding. I have taken my cooker and in this I'll be putting two cups of water. I will place this vessel in the cooker and now very gently pour this mixture in the vessel. I have now closed the cooker. I will keep the gas on high flame, give it one whistle and after one whistle make it slow and cook till another two whistles. After those two whistles you can put the gas off, let it cool down and only then open the cooker. Also while removing the vessel from inside the cooker, please be careful that the vessel is cooled down completely. Do not try to remove the vessel from the cooker when it's hot. Hey, so if you like my video, please do make it at home. Do subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more with Kami Trails. Do not go to the restaurant. Make the desert right at home. Thank you.